नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नेम क्रिस सगर्रा प्रोफेशन स्टूडेंट सिटी कंट्री ऑफ रेसिडेंट्स गुमाका क्यूजॉन फिलिपीन वॉट इज द बेस्ट सब्जेक्ट फील्ड टू चूज एज अ बिगनर इन द फील्ड ऑफ सीकिंग इस्लामिक नॉलेज इन द इस्लामिक यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ मदीना बिकॉज आई हैव बीन ग्रांटेड अ चांस टू स्टडी देयर आई मीन आई बॉट शुड आई टेक शरिया अकीदा कुरान हदीत अरबिक जजा कमुल्ला खैरन या शेख इट इज बिकॉज ऑल ऑफ माई फैमिली मेम्बर्स आर ऑल नॉन मुस्लिम एंड आई एम द ओनली वन हू एक्सेप्टेड इस्लाम एंड आई एम द ओनली वन हू स्टडिंग इस्लाम हेयर इन आ प्लेस काइंडली गिव मी सम गाइडेंस आई एम द यंगेस्ट इन अवर सिबलिंग नाइनटीन ईयर्स ओल्ड क्रिस सिगारा फ्राम फ्रॉम फिलिपीन माशा ही एक्सेप्टेड इस्लाम एंड ही इज बीन ग्रांटेड एडमिशन इन द इस्लामिक यूनिवर्सिटी मदीना विच इज़ वन ऑफ द बेस्ट Islamic universities for studying Islam in the world, and all his family members are non-Muslims. He is asking, what should he take? Should he take Sharia, or Hadith, or Tafsir, or Deen, etc.? Uh, what should he take? Studying in Medina, taking bachelor than any of the Islamic studies is good, mashallah. But if given the choice, I personally advise that if you want to be a dai whichever field you take no problem but the best amongst all available i advise to take bachelor's in sharia first but naturally you have to do two years of mahad that learning arabic language and after you finish your mahad in arabic which is compulsory for all you are 19 years old you have to learn arabic as a language for two years and after you finish the arabic course then i would request you that you should join sharia there is even tafsir of the quran there is hadith then then there is also on the usul ud din but i personally prefer sharia because sharia includes tafsir hadith as well as fiqh so and especially for knowing the reasons of why the rulings are there in islam and the fatwa and the fiqh sharia is my first choice so normally i prefer advising people sharia and then after that you can either take tafsir or hadith there's no problem and the last would be usul ud din but the first choice if you get admission preferably i would advise you to take sharia because that includes studying tafsir of the quran includes studying hadith and also includes fiqh and this when you learn fiqh you you have have the knowledge of how to give arguments and what are the reasons and in skills which will help you more helpful for dawa you can do dawa even with tafsir even with hadith etc but sharia would be the first option inshallah i pray to allah subhanahu wa taala that may he grant you knowledge and make you a good dai so that you can convey the message to your family members to your friends and your other non muslim colleagues and may allah subhanahu wa taala give you jannat al firdaus and accept your efforts in this way